Fuck Keith Richards. Fuck all those dudes that survived the 60s, flying around on Lear jets, living up their gunslinger reputation as they fuck supermodels in the most expensive hotel in Paris. It's like, you know what Lemmy's doing? Lemmy's probably drinking Jack and Cokes and writing another record. Lemmy was at the beginning of heavy metal. You know, maybe even pre-Black Sabbath. Without Lemmy, there'd be, like, Motorhead, there'd be no Metallica, no Megadeth, no Slayer, nothing. There wouldn't be any of the heavy metal we have today. There's no words to describe him, really. He's just the fucking legend that is Lemmy. He's like God, you know? Man's the modern Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. To be honest, he's fucking Jesus Christ. Yeah. Rock and roll, he's Lemmy. Lemmy, he's rock and roll. If we were in the 17th century, you don't think he'd be a pirate? All the guys in Motorhead, they're pirates. He's Captain Hook. I know a lot of rock and roll personalities, and the ones that I admire and the ones that I'm drawn towards are the ones that are fucking the real deal. You know, the people that live, sleep, and breathe rock and roll is a lifestyle, an attitude. And he represents that to me, and there's only a handful of guys that are still alive that represent them. When someone gets so big that what they do musically is just an asterisk for what they represent, you know? I mean, there's, there's few people that attain that sort of stature. An immeasurable influence Lemmy has had. Staying true to your beliefs and being an inspiration to all. All. Everything he delivers is, is, is sincere and authentic in a sense, you know. It's rock and roll, it's simple, but it's done real. Nobody told him to do anything that he wasn't completely natural and comfortable doing. And that's rare, man. And that's why I think we respond uh, with respect, because um, we want to be like that. any other rock musician. He is the baddest motherfucker in the world. Little kid on the corner in Soho, four o'clock in the morning. This cop comes around the corner and said, hello, Sonny. The kid says, all right, you know. He said, what are you doing? He said, I'm looking for a whore. And how old are you? He said, I'm nine, right? He said, what do you want a whore for? He said, I want to get a disease. He said, what kind of fucking disease? He said, a sexually transmitted one, officer. The guy said, well, what do you want to get a fucking disease for? He said, well, if I get it, I go home and I fuck the babysitter and she gets it. And she fucks my dad and he gets it. And he fucks my mum and she gets it and she fucks the gardener, and that's the cunt I'm after because he squashed my frog. 